Hello everybody and welcome back to my playthrough of Fatal Frame Maiden of Blackwater by Nintendo and Koei Tecmo. So last time we played this, we played 7, 8, 7, 8 and 9 drops. So now we're gonna do 10 and 11 because that's the best way I can see of segmenting this since uh, the final drop is a bit too is a bit too long if you're not fast enough you can clock in, in about two hours so this is the best way we can divide the episodes per uh, the chapters per episode so this time we'll be playing as Ren Hojo for the tenth drop and now let's see what happens next where we need to find Rui. Uh, Ren goes in search of Rui, who has vanished from the antiques shop. He heads to the Veiled House, which is where he saw Rui in his dream. Dude had one job, and that was to watch over the girls <laughs> via CCTV, and, he st and he still he fell asleep. Uh, okay. Tenth drop, ghost marriage, Ren Hojo. <coughs> I'm sorry. Ren checks the surveillance footage, only to discover that Rui has also been back on the way to the mountain. He recalls the dream he had after he fell asleep. Rui was inside the Veiled House, aka the Watarai Residence. Ren knows this is where he must head next. In my dream, Rui was in that folklorist's house, the one we searched before. I should check it out again. I might find a clue which will lead me to Rui. Check the items and items first. Oh. So apparently we fought a dead Harukomomose at some point. We are still not reading any of these, but we're gonna see if there's anything interesting to read. None. None whatsoever. Nothing interesting. That's good to know, I guess. The fuck is that? That wasn't there before. According to the map, there should be a swamp here. Should be. And... Yet... There isn't. There is an entire structure here that wasn't there before. Door must be locked from the other side. Wall is falling apart, I might be able to break find a way in. Hang on, I think I forgot to turn on my cool boost again. Okay, there we go. Cool boost is on. There it is. Nope, not that way. Okay. Sorry about that. What even is this place? Hall of Fire? That's a new, isn't it? must be locked from the other side. So Men by the fire.
There's something down there. I'm not sure how to get there. There's always beep to open stuff. Crafting reliquaries. You attack me? I hope not. He's looking at me. Oh god. Okay. Black reliquaries. There's an old text lying on the floor. It mentions reliquaries and black water. The reliquaries protect the maidens from the black water. They are filled with black wa the black water and the maiden is shut inside. Oh my god, dude, shut up! The maiden becomes a pillar protecting the pure water. The reliquaries prevent the pillar from melting away, keeping her within the water. They must not be opened before the pillar has crumbled. The only one who can open the reliquary is the one inside. So what if she opens it? <laughs> what if it's open from the inside? What happens then? can't get there Where even am I at this point? Doors are unlocked Which door is this? Oh the other door, okay flame keepers. An old text has been left atop a burning altar. It seems to be about being a flame keeper. The forbidden flame mustn't go out. It purifies water and drives back the darkness. The forbidden flame fends off the black water. Only those who hold the flame can stand the shadow spring. The forbidden flame must remain. I knew it! So I might have missed this bit in my playthrough. I might have neglected to enter this room. But I knew it! I knew it! They were gonna come for me! Shoot them! Shoot them, man! Shoot them, these barmy bastards are gonna come for me! Whoa! Just in the nick of time! Ooh, 
we didn't come here. We need to get to the full forest's house. I may have I, I really may have neglected to come here in my switch playthrough. <laughs> I guess I don't recall this happening to me. Then stay note too. An old text has been left by the fire altar. I can see black stains in several places. The mountain must end. You must take it with you. Do not leave it behind. Do not allow it to linger. We are recording, right? Yes, ten minutes in. Door is on up. Alright. Time to move on, I guess. We gotta go back to the Shrine of Dolls. Why? Well, we just gotta. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding, because it's the... Wait. Whoa! Fuck you again! Well, if that wasn't gonna activate Fatal Frame, I might as well shovel chance the crap out of this bitch. <laughs> Stop screaming, jeez. Embarrassing yourself. What? Okay, come on, bitch. I'll just die already! Touch. Okay, what's your story, lady? Call facing this woman. I, maybe I shouldn't have gone this way. I guess. What the hell? Oh 
okay, I guess. Stop switching film because that's gonna get me in trouble one of these days. Bugger me. I'm gonna have to ask you to cease and desist. Where are you now? Where are you now, you barmy bastard? For it to get closer than that. Disappear without me touching you, bitch. That sounds wrong. It's always you, huh? Always the one at the crime scene. Oh, shinies. Let me get the shinies. This is. <laughs> this is how trouble usually finds me. Because I want to get the shinies. <laughs> so I usually get myself in trouble in horror games. Let's just go. Yeah, we gotta go. Girl with the red umbrella. I just want this, so... Should we, like, follow her? Probably a bad idea, but we're gonna do it anyway. Woman offering flowers. Anywhere else? Jeez, where am I anyway? It's time for us to go back to where we started. Just head to the doll shrine. I have no idea where else she could be leading me. Let's just go. Because I didn't follow her, to be honest. I didn't think she was going anywhere else. I didn't follow her else. I didn't follow her before. So I thought she was just a one time, big time ghost that you have to take a shot of. Mm. 
map doesn't show the location of the veiled house. My best bet is to go through the tunnel below the Shrine of Dolls again and hope it appears like last time. That's for 15 minutes. Is there anything down here? Maybe some goodies? some goodies but let's hope that nothing pops out of us out of us while we're here yep something popped out you son of a bitch You're not gonna take me! Is too far. Whoa, three of them! Horrible decisions were made today. Just plain horrible decisions were made today. Because <laughs> we decided to go down here. <laughs> See if we can upgrade ca the camera. so many of them. I'm gonna cry. Why are there so many dolls? Ah! Sa I didn't notice them. Yo me! Yo! Dude! Jeez! I'm a clingy bitch! <laughs> Shergigus Journal 1. A journal with a white chrysanthemum emblem. This belongs to the white haired girl. Until I am seven, I am with the gods. I am unborn. When I turn seven, I will be human. That's why I will become a pillar before I turn seven. I am not long for this life, but if I become a pillar, I will not die. I will be an immortal flower. I will go on forever, undying. But will I be alone forever?
Okay. I think we're making good time. Get a rescue the assistant again. Forced outskirts. Proceed. There we go. There she is again. Oh God, she's lost. One film, we got type 61 film. Alright, that's some good film, I guess. Well, let's go. Kazuya Sakaki in the hallway. Stairs worth noting about. Just here. Alright, so anything there? Anything here maybe? An item? Something like that. No? Yes. Right. Ruiz Journal 5. Follow Ruiz Journal since she came here after all. Mr. Hojo came for me once before. He'll come for me again. I'm waiting. I will keep waiting. Waiting is all I can do. Type 24, great. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh 
my god, there she is. We're in the second floor, in case you guys forget. Jesus, the fuck? Forest's note 8. Found old notebook about this. The old text found that the shrines tell of a disaster. The waters, tainted in black, flowed down the waterfalls, sullying the pools and becoming a became a black mist that enveloped the mountain. The sun turned a muddy crimson, the border between the worlds blurred. Now the waters are clear and the mists are white. It is unknown whether this disaster actually happened or whether it was passed down as a mere cautionary tale. If it really did occur, must, what must the locals have thought? Did the mountain rumble, appearing shrouded in black shadows? Did the rivers look like long strands of black hair? Did people see the black water running down the paths? The truth is unclear. What is clear is that the waters are now are clean, clean and pure. Not that. I suppose that's an easy escape route, if anything. black box in the middle of the room. Dark stains mark the floor as if something has seeped out. Film. Film. We need that. Damn it! Let me get the film! Stupid clunky controls! Where am I? You tell me! <laughs> Kazuya's note 1. New looking notes have been dropped here. I recognize the handwriting. It's Kazuya's. I don't know where I am or how I got here. The last thing I remember is calling him on the phone. Maybe he could have stopped me. I would. If he could have stopped me, I wouldn't have ended up here. The ceremony will start soon. This is the end. Motherfucker, is that dude seriously blaming us for what happened to him? Dr. Asso's records 1. An old book with a blue cover has fallen on the floor. The name Kunihiko Asso is on the spine. This must have been left by Dr. Asso, inventor of the camera obscura. As photography is still so expensive, it's common to dress the deceased up for post-mortem photographs. Upon seeing those pictures, I decided to make a camera. Post-mortem photographs are more than simple mementos. They capture death and the soul in a way that I can. I devoted myself completely to making a camera that could capture what we can't see. As soon as I had a working prototype, I began taking post-mortem photographs. I traveled the country, taking photographs of dead bodies. What the fuck, yo? <laughs> people were thankful to have the subject spirits preserved. The people in Tamai, Ayukawa, and Katase near Mount Hikami are particularly elated. They said they were like the pillars. 
but this is still not the camera I was after. It still only captures visible light. I have to capture what the eye cannot, the portion composed of shadows. If I do, perhaps I can prove the existence of an invisible world. That never ends well, so, you know. You know, never mess with things that you should, that shouldn't be messed with, really. <laughs> like, stop that. If you want to live, stop doing that. Not from the other side. Where should we go next, I guess? One way to go but down. Let's just hope no spooks come out at us. choosing a bride. Grooms are brought in from other places. The groom makes his choice from illustrated votives. The wedding celebrant calls upon the chosen immortal flower and the two are brought together. The immortal flowers are waiting for someone to join them in their caskets. All they can do is wait for a partner. They cannot choose. That is the immortal flower's final wish. Okay, bro. Close your smoke, too. I'm so scared. I can't stop shaking. I have to go. I chose her, so we have to die together. She's been waiting for so long. Sick doo doo, did you get yourself into this time, dude? Huh. Okay, so it just cuts off there, I guess. Alright then. Explore this area first. Not this for 31 minutes. Mm. Ah! I guess so is he gonna come out or is he just gonna stay there? <laughs> ah, yeah, he'll, he'll come out. Are you? I guess I gotta open the door now. <laughs> oh crap! So cramped here, holy shit. Where is he?
Bride Hood to make out the worst words Ghost Marriage. The bride has chosen an audience with her groom. If the man can look on the black water with unwavering resolve, the ghost marriage is successful. If he fails, he shall be set placed in a separate relic arm. The bride will be returned to her casket alone to wait on you for, for, any, for another selection. So we went back to the start, I guess. Yeah, at least we got some goodies out of it. again so I just noticed that if you kill bring them their masks fall off oh god Tables. What? What the fuck is that? Should have taken the shot, I guess. What just happened there? I do not know what just happened there. What the fuck was that? Nice try, bitch. Stupid tables. Those tables are like trapping me. And I hate it so much. Thing, but you can unlock. What is that supposed to mean? Okay, now I have to use an item. Okay, I should have used the sacred water right off the bat. That's it. You bitches are getting the type 14. <laughs> Just stay in one place with your pal, dude!
touch her now, Jesus Christ. Okay, you are starting to piss me off, lady. <laughs> Because I got too close to the door behind me. That's why they activated and that other dude disappeared. Who <laughs> these goddamn tea tables, man? All that for this stupid notebook. <laughs> Regarding bridegrooms. Bridegroom's soul, after the ghost marriage, is bound with the bride and placed with her in the casket so that the pillar can remain strong. The votive of the, the, votive of the wedding is finished, and the groom's soulless body is interred in the Forbidden Valley. The souls of men driven mad by the ghost marriage are enshrined in, an arm, in unmarked graves in the Forbidden Valley. Also, oh, those mounds that we saw. The corpse is placed in a reliquary alone and interred in the depths of the womb cavern. Forty-seven minutes. We've been at this for forty-seven minutes. Yokuirashaimashita. <laughs> What the hell did you just call me? I am not Kunihiko Aso. That dude died in Himuru Mansion years ago. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, we're just gonna follow the creepy old lady, huh, Ren? No hesitation whatsoever, just follow her. <laughs> She does kind of look like Rui. Whoa! Oh. Oh, the mist is showing up again. Rui! Rui, wake up! Wake up!
anything else there? Damn it. Let's just take the shortcut, I suppose. I'm so glad they didn't make this like a timed segment. <laughs> that shit would have driven me crazy if they had. here because it's locked. Man, should have unlocked this earlier. Ah! Rui, jeez! Uh, Rui jump scares me more than any ghost in this game. So there's like an exit here. I guess we have to go that way. What are you talking about, dude? Dude's seriously blaming us for how he died. <laughs> so that's that really sad, sad, like what's going on. <laughs> ah, there we go. That was a uh, risk we should not have taken. Well, we eat those two out of the house, and we can't touch them. Alright, let's just try to get out of here, I guess. Yes, yes, I'm aware where to use it. Of course that box just had to open, didn't it? Come on, attack me, attack me. Give you a reason to, bitch.
notes are crumpled and heavily damaged or something like that. It was over the moment I saw that photograph. I'm done for. The moment I fixed my eyes on that lonely face, I bound myself to her. I know that if I change my mind, I'm dead. I've been chosen to be her doom. I have to go now. She's been waiting for so long. She's waiting just ahead, but not for me. She's waiting for another. Alright, let's just get out of here, man. To feel sorry for him later. Back in the cable car. I probably just broke my S my S rank streak in and I had the amount of items I had to use. Oh, okay, Ruby, give me some space. Give the man some space. Ren found Rui in a reliquary in the failed house, only to be pulled in himself. He awoke in an unfamiliar building. An old woman dressed in white led Ren to a room in which Rui was waiting, dressed as a bride. This seemed to be the room in which weddings between the living and the dead are held. Rui suddenly changed into a fearsome bride wearing black. Then in a flash, they were back in the folklorist's house. There they encountered Ren's friend Kazuya, whose own wedding to a ghost went horribly wrong. The veiled house vanished into the mist, with Kazuya still inside. That dude's dead. <laughs> S plus, yes! I did not break my streak after all. She been unlocked, ghost man. I love how we started our streak at <laughs> chapter 5. We just went crazy onwards. 11th drop, Miyu Hinasaki. Find Miku Hinasaki. Alright. Miyu's mother, Miku, is on Mount Hikami. Convinced of this, Miyu takes the camera obscura from Yuri's room while she sleeps. Shadowborn. 11th drop to Shadowborn. Miyu Hinasaki. Having brought Mi Yuri back from the Lake of the Departed, Miyu stays a while at the antique shop. Convinced her mother, Miku Hinasaki, is somewhere on Mount Hikami. Miyu knows the only way to find her is to follow her shadow. To do so, she needs the help of Yuri's camera obscura. So that slow thing that Miyu can do, I don't actually use it that much. <laughs> Some other's trace disappear in the cemetery. Maybe I'll be able to find something if I examine it using the camera obscura. Wonder if I can borrow it one more time. Camera should be in the She's kind of flat compared to the other characters, isn't she? <laughs> and yet the amount of gain axing remains. <laughs> Soko's journal 3. Small notebook has been left in this. Looks like Miss Kurosawa's journal. I never did learn why Akari went missing. I guess she took that secret to the grave. It may seem trivial to other people, but it must have been important to her. Maybe people really can't understand one another. I managed to save Yuri. I don't know why she went missing though. When I touch her, I see nothing. Maybe there was no reason, and that worries me, like peering through darkness. Yuri will leave someday. 
It's okay if I don't know why. It's okay if we don't really understand each other. As long as she's in my arms, Yuri will be here with me. Methinks Hisoka likes Yuri more than a legal guardian should. <laughs> I ship. <laughs> I ship it a lot. <laughs> See, y y y there's no heterosexual explanation for that. As long as she's in my arms, Yuri will be here with me. <laughs> okay, let's just go. Let's move on. Man, having a mirror like that is freaky. I don't want a mirror in my own home. Looks like she's having a bad dream. The camera obscure at my disposal will find me for sure. Some notes and photographs under the camera. This is from when my mother went missing? Why would you really have this? Oh, that's left of it now is the case. So for those who don't know, in Fatal Frame 1, uh, Miku had a camera obscura. Your mother was spirited away because she made a bad decision. <laughs> so it's not the camera obscura that caused that. But in Fatal Frame 1, Miku had a camera obscura that was destroyed in the final battle. So, I'm not, not, so they probably still have it. Yuri's notebook too. Notebook has been left on the desk. It looks like Yuri's dying. When did I realize I could see things that others could not? When did I realize I could hear the voices of dead people? They tell me things. They whisper to me the same things over and over. I had to cover my ears so that I don't accidentally listen. If I listen to them, I'll know. And if I know, I'll accept it. Many, many, many voices are all talking, all talking to me. It doesn't make any sense. Only I could stop them from whispering to me. And that kid is why she decided to commit, try and commit suicide. She must, have, she must have thought she was going crazy or something. Poor kid. Still crazy on the upgrades. Um, I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. Please get out of my house. <laughs> I'm gonna have to ask you to vacate the premises. So there was a note here I, that I forgot when we were doing the tower defense level. <laughs> I forgot to grab it before. So that's bye bye note and bye bye achievement for getting all notes. <laughs> there is one. I haven't checked. I forgot. <laughs> I guess we're leaving now. Now I have the camera on the screen a photograph of my mother. I'll be able to follow her trace. This time I'll find her. We make a lot of bad decisions, don't we? <laughs> Ephemeral station. I see that your mother you're following your mother's footsteps in the bad decisions department.
No, I like I like this camera obscura better than Rens. Rens may have rapid fire, but there's the drawback of slow ass loading time afterwards. This one on the other hand, no drawback. You just need spirit power. Can't only one of these. Alright, waste four of them then. <laughs> It's like what we do. We just waste film. <laughs> Get to that sweet, sweet 75 spot so we'll have 99 type 14s after this. <laughs> I really hope the the game doesn't make me, make me pay for it in the rankings later. <laughs> Ah! Dude. Classy, dude. Very classy. Out of bounds. Oh, there we go. You can touch him now. Hang on. Somebody has texted me, and I must respond. Yes. Press back. Jeez. See if there are any goodies that we can pick up around here. Like a film or something. Let's just continue on. Of course. Of course. We just had to be out of spirit power at this point, don't we? Oh, that dude almost hit us.
Oh, we can't touch them. I guess. Oh, that's unfortunate. This is where we go, Spider Lily Byway. So we're not gonna check out this latter half no more. It's probably just items there that we no longer need. So let's just continue on, because it would also be a waste of time to check. Especially if it turns out that there's nothing there. I suppose let's check up to here to the cherry blossom plateau. How much trouble we keep going places that we shouldn't be going. <laughs> Why do we do that? Why do we do this to ourselves? Hair stone. Definitely useful. Stay there and keep your points, man. Okay, let's go. Let's just go. Sake before ghost match. What? This was blocked before. Yeah, that was true. It was blocked before. <laughs> the house of joining. Why did then?
When you spooks better show up out of nowhere, I swear to god. Sakin, the house of joining. Not for me, Kutu. Did my mother do this? I was abandoned. Four years ago, Miyu came into my life. But now I have to leave her. And then you abandoned her. How nice. <laughs> I don't have long left. I can feel that the end is close. Everyone dies alone, but I don't want to be alone. I've learned the thing called ghost marriage. Um, I don't know, man. I don't know what. So far. I don't want to spoil what her rationale is for leaving me behind, but it's pretty damn stupid, especially if you were a fan of the previous games and you've played The Tormented. Uh, if you've, and if and you've played Phil Frame 3, uh, you'll realize soon that it's actually pretty damn stupid. <laughs> so we're here, so I uh, let's try using Ando, I guess. Yeah. Uh give me a moment. Her rationale gets pretty damn stupid, I swear to god. It's annoying. Oh! Ah! Gotcha! Gotcha, gotcha! <laughs> Bind lens. The lens that freezes the photographs. Take it under photo and do it. Oh yeah, this one's pretty damn useful. So let's switch the slow lens out for bind lens. Excuse me. Yeah, I'll must be hearing me burp right now. Spell because it's so cramped. Pull a fast one on me. It's not gonna work, dude. Damn it! 
that sounds damn stupid because Can't even touch him. Okay, where are we? So he's gone. Note from Ren. Notebook has been left on the floor. Did it belong to the person staying in this room? I had that dream again. The one where I swing that knife down on a girl in a ceremony. Before I bring down the knife, our eyes meet. When they do, I feel a jolt of fear like she's seeing into my soul. The girl then falls into a box. Did it really happen? If it was real, then what happened to that girl? When I woke up, my pulse was pounding. I am beset with overwhelming regret, pain, and sadness. Ceremony must be from that summer when I was a boy, when I stayed with the Aso family at, on Mount Kagiroi. I'd play with the local children all over the place, even on the grounds of Kagiroi Shrine until the sun set. I think that's when it must have started. I've been thinking about going back to Mount Kagiroi for some time now. I'm scared of learning the truth about the, that dream. I heard it's all been demolished. Maybe there's nothing left to tell me if it's a dream or not. Oh, for God's, for God's sakes. There we go, because that's so hard, jeez. game makes things unnecessarily difficult with its controls. Good thing we got that. So that's where we just took a peek. 
for no reason at all. The mirror just like in the photo. Shadow disappeared from the picture. Yep, nope, uh, totally a good omen. Door opening by itself. Touch me, are you- Touch me, are you gonna attack me? Please. <laughs> touch me sounds so wrong. <laughs> oh! This is so dumb! On this level, go with <laughs> Whoa! I don't know why I was using the type 14, this is just one person. <laughs> one very dead person who also wants me dead. Yeah, get that. Well, we yeeted her out of the room. I suppose we can't touch her. Uh, we can! <laughs> Look at that. Maybe we can touch her after all. Oh, no. We can't. We, we can't touch her. Okay, then. I miss that in my Switch playthrough too. <laughs> Let's see if there's like uh No. <laughs> our last save was so our last auto save was so long ago. Oh, I can't catch that trace anymore. It's annoying. Oh, that's just dirty. Just for that, I'm gonna use a Type 61 on you. Please. There we go. 
can't touch her again. Oh, At least drop something. Oh wait, she did. <laughs> no, from Miku three. Is she here? Did my mother eat this? I have to go now. I could always see things no one could else could see. Only Mafuyu could understand me. I could never tell him how I feel though. He left before I could tell him. I could never look him in the eye. He'd have known how I feel if I let myself look at him like that. It was difficult being with him, but it was better than being alone. You do realize Mafuyu is your older brother, right, Niku? <laughs> He doesn't need to understand me. I don't need to be with him forever. If I can just ease my brother's suffering from a mo for a moment as he keeps the gates of the underworld sealed. In the end, who will be by my side? Let me do this, please. Forgive me. Your brother chose to suffer, so... I don't think that's your responsibility anymore. Jeez, lady. You abandoned your child for a brother who chose death. <laughs> This is why I think that it threw this game, uh, Miku's arc in this game, Miku and Miku's arc in this game, uh, throws away all the lessons that Fail Frame 3 put in place. I wanna pick up that ember, you stupid game, jeez. I have to stand at a specific spot just to pick it up. Like, control game, uh,. Play wise, this game is clunk. Didn't even bother fixing the clunk. She is pretty, though. <laughs> Isn't she pretty? She's my best girl in this game. You ain't taking her a second time. Not if I have anything to say about it. Oh, oh, ah! The analog stick went crazy there for a moment. Come on, give me some space. It gives too much of the good film now. Too much for my taste, so gonna go back to the shitty film. <laughs>
мол! That was the most annoying boss fight I've seen. <laughs> because I can't see what's behind me. And for some reason I'm being blocked by something. <laughs> White Diary. The ghost marriage allows pillars to persist longer. Maidens who become pillars must be bound to someone. Sad though it may be, no maiden can endure the pain they suffer within the reliquary on her own. We brought many men to wed Ose, but they all had a change of heart. The joinings failed. I feel she might be waiting for Master Aso to come back to her. But even if he does, there is no guarantee that she will be the one he chooses. They may have made a f promise, but we know that outsiders have fickle hearts. I'll just open the damn box! Admitted her up the mountain to the house of dreams. So you decide to abandon your child in the care of some stranger just because you didn't have much time left. It is painful, man, to see a beloved character be reduced to this. I'm surprised she recognized who that is. <laughs> Been gone for 17 years. <laughs> Mia's mother, Mia's mother, she has been able to see ghosts since childhood. When she lost her brother, her only blood relative, she moved in with her brother's friend and started working as his assistant. That was you, Aso, from Fatal Frame 3. Fatal Frame 3. When she got pregnant, she moved to a house owned by an old woman she knew, and it, it was there she gave birth to Mia. She disappeared when Mia was just three years old. I'm sick. Fuck me. <laughs> Sick fuck. Left your own daughter for a dead man. Touch me or what? Ah, damn it!
Nice try, lady. Touch them both. I get to touch. I can see Miku trying to run out the room from here. Ah, oh, there she is. She just teleported behind me. How long have we been at this? 35 minutes. Alright, let's go. Wrong door. <laughs> oh, come on! Just let me go in peace, jeez! water it is then. <laughs> oh! You want me to die? Spirit power, you ass hat. <laughs> ah, no, we didn't touch him. Didn't touch him. Guess that's that. Let's just get out of here. Oof, there's something hurting. Me hurty somewhere. Me hurty somewhere. I'm hurting somewhere. Let's go. Let's get out of here. I'm leaving you behind the second time if you don't walk faster, I swear to god. <laughs> nah, she'll follow, she'll find us. Corazon's antiques. Yes! Made it. Home free. Yes, sleep now. Excuse me. Mia finally found Miku on Mount Ikami, where she had entered into a ghost marriage at the house of joining. Miku explained her desperate wish to be reunited with her beloved brother, pleading for Miu's forgiveness. Miu led her mother away from the mountain and back to the antiques shop. Miu and Miku lay side by side and quickly fell into a deep sleep. I probably missed a few things though, <laughs> considering how how I basically speed ran this entire level. Chimmy unlocked the Shadowborn. Twelve drop. Rukos got to find his own So yeah, so that's that for now. 
we've played 10th and 11th drops and next time we'll be playing 12 and 13 before we finally do we do the last drop on a separate episode but yeah that's it for now guys i'm pretty sure you guys can <laughs> hear my disappointment in miku in this <laughs> while doing the 11th drop but maybe someday i'll explain why that is in the future but yeah that's it for now guys bye